What's good, everybody? We're back with some more Hogwarts Legacy A. In the last episode, we did some Hogwarts shenanigans. I was running around doing some side quests, but today... Yes, Nasty. Then let's get to it. Yes. <laughs> you know what time it is. Ready to get thrashed? Hello. Hey, who's shorty next to you? Apologies in advance. Three of y'all. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Natty, you ready? Breakthrough Violet Shield with four spells. Like the summoning charm. Accio. Target lock la lets you. Wait, what? Yo, I'm kind of nervous. All right, hold up. Let's go. Put a work. Ooh. Ooh, you missed that one. Come here. You say I'm the one? Really? Oh. Oh, this is actually legitimately hard. Oh no. Oh, I didn't know I could heal. I'm about to lose. Let's go. That was crazy. I could never duel like that. That was absolutely insanity. Bravo. I gave it my all. You did indeed. The other duelists have already taken notice of you. But after that last round, they'll really have it in for you. You'd better keep practicing if you want a chance at winning. <laughs> or at least surviving the next round. I'll let you know when we're ready. Jeez. Hope to see you then. Bruh. The next round is for all the gobstones, so to speak. I can't lie. That was extremely intense. Ho, ho, ho. Can I talk to you? Hey, shawty. What? Seems I'm out of the tournament thanks to you. Oh, dang, Narita. I'm sorry, mama. Like, you don't want to be friends? Okay. Uh complete a round of spell combination practice with spell combination practice with Lucan. Okay, that sounds interesting enough. I kinda wanna do that. It sounds complicated. Um alright, so in the one of the earlier episodes, I'll leave a link down in the description below. We picked up apparently some type of uh potions making kit but i haven't been taught how to use it so i'm completely out of all healing items so if we get into any <laughs> if we catch any smoke from anybody i'm probably gonna lose my life and i'm really curious like okay this is my head cannon. if i get injured or if i pass out in school what happens like do I wake up in a hospital wing? Is there a hospital wing? I want to say that there is one. Where it is, I have no idea. There is, look at that, there is a hospital wing. How much you want to bet if you pass out in school, you're going to wake up at a hospital wing. But do you like lose the items that you had on you? Does it cost like money? I got questions. Ugh. All right, but let's keep it moving. Let's keep it moving. Yeah, that was crazy. I thought I lost that one, but I held in at the, to the end, so it is what it is. Uh, 
Make sure we save the game often. Yeah. Sheesh. One assignment. All right, Professor Hackett's assignment. So we can go back and go learn Incendio right now, or we can do some spell combination practice. What's the reward for this? Yeah, I, I wouldn't mind. I, I want to do some practicing too, because that was a lot harder than what I expected it to be. Hello, Lucan. May I use the training dummy? Of course. I'll fetch it and give you a list of combinations to practice. Ready to have a try now? Yes, sir. That would be wonderful. Be sure to cast all of your spells before the dummy lands. If you need to stop practicing before you finish all of them, let me know. Okay. Excellent form. Bet. Let's go. Okay. Nicely done. Let me go. Okay, huh? Hold on, run that back. Oh, snap it moves. Jeez, let's go. I'd say that's enough practice. You looked good out there. Thank you, Lucan. I say better to discover one's weaknesses during practice than during a duel. You'll be a fearsome challenger now. Wait, wait, wait. Can I run that back? I want to practice. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. That was cool. I would Assignment's all finished. Professor Hackett's assignment. Oh, I finished it? That was actually part of it? I didn't know. Yo, yo, yo. No, no, no. Lucan. Lucan, my guy. My guy. My young guy. Hey, where are you going, young Gryffindor? Hey. Come on. Yo, I was legit trying to... <laughs> I'm trying to practice with a dummy real quick. Like... That was a whole lot harder than what I thought it would be. Hello? What's happening? How you feeling? Do you know who I am? I'm the chosen one. Okay, I guess you don't care. <laughs> Never mind. Uh, Let's get back to Professor Hackett then. Rotate this real quick. Uh... All right, Professor, you know what time it is. I've always said that travel broadens the mind. Did you? Ooh. I trust Mr. Brattleby was able to accommodate you and that you found success in your endeavors. Yes, I did. Thank you. I finished all of the tasks you gave me, Professor Hackett. Glad to hear it. Then you should be ready to learn Incendio. Should be, Professor. Yes. I'm sorry to say I visited enough careless colleagues at St. Mungo's to assure you that fire is a fickle servant. Your spellcasting has impressed me thus far, but please maintain focus. I would rather we not end today's lesson with your robes aflame. Let us begin. And remember, focus on the proper wand movement. Concentrate and keep your wand steady. All right, bet I got this. Ready? One shot. Yes, sir. Easy. All right, we got the incendio. You have learned enough spells that you need to equip Incendio to your spell set. To do this, you need to swap it with a different spell. Good work. Okay. Allows you to see in the dark area or solve puzzles that require light. Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't really need... Alright, what do I not need right now? 
I'm gonna say I don't need Reparo right now. Its range is short and requires you to be close to the target. This spell deals significant damage and lights certain objects on fire. Okay. Enemies hit with the fire base attacks will continue to take damage for a few seconds. Okay, so they take fire damage. That's good to know. To use a spell or item, you must first add it to your spell set. That makes sense. Hover over Incendio, hold R2, and tap the corresponding face of the button that you want to change it with. See, this is so... Mm. Only for now, for now, for now. Because I haven't been repairing anything. I mean, I haven't needed Luminous either. In yeah, it's fine. It's fine. You have unlocked rewards. Let's get it. All right, return to Professor Fig's classroom. His heavy damage spell that unleashes destructive flames. Incendiary. it. Keep at it. And do Setting things ablaze is certainly cathartic, isn't it? That cooldown is crazy. Jeez. Move, Mr. Um, I'm trying to actually not hit you and hit this for, for once. Hold on, if I, what if I stand right here? There we go. I got it. Okay, I just didn't need to do that. <laughs> I was just bullying this thing for no reason. You know what? Just for old time's sake. Come here. Yo, you. Dang, you could destroy things in this game. Like if you really get fancy with the um the magic. I'm loving it. Hold up. Wait, wait, wait. There's a mission right here. Um, Duncan seems to have a pup skin problem. I wonder if I can help him out. Yo, we can track that real quick. I'll go talk to Duncan or whatever his name is. Let me teleport. Mm. So we'll go see Duncan and then we'll talk back to Professor Fig. Oh, he was right outside the classroom. Really? My bad. He's downstairs. Okay. Spare a moment. I could use your help. I'm listening. Talk to me. You wanted to speak with me. I did. Hello. I'm Duncan Hobhouse. Nice to meet Pleasure you. Pleasure to meet you. Yeah. Same. I've heard all about you, of course. Confronting trolls and dragons. I've had some good luck. Why, thank you. That's nice to hear. I have had my share of adventure. I hope my reputation's warranted. I'm going to presume your reputation is, in fact, warranted. In which case, you are precisely the person I need. I'm listening. You see, we were learning to repel boggarts in Professor Hecate's class. And, mm. well, mine unfortunately took the shape of a, a puff scheme. What's a puff scheme? What's to be scared of? Are you afraid of your own shadow too? They can be scary. They're adorable. Why would you be afraid of a puff scheme? They seem adorable until one sticks its tongue up your nose. Oh, Regardless of how reasonable I believe my fear of puff schemes to be, I'm beginning to get a reputation as a coward. Okay. Some have even taken to calling me Puff Scheme Dunkeen. Mm. Uh, I'm sorry, but you have to admit that's rather clever. I do not have to admit that. Everett said the same thing. Anyway, sorry, I'm sorry. To make matters worse, <laughs> I stupidly blurted out that I must be braver than people think since I have been in the Hidden Herbology Corridor. The Hidden Herbology Corridor? Yes. Rumor has it that the Herbology Professor before Professor Garlic kept dangerous plants there. It's supposedly so overrun now that no one dares enter it anymore. 
I was hoping you could go there and bring back evidence that I could use to show that, well, I'd gone in. Say a bit of an exceptionally dangerous plant of some kind. I'll see what I can do. What? Yeah, what should I expect before I pull up and, um... What sort of plants should I expect in the hidden herbology corridor? I haven't a clue. But have you seen the kinds of plants Professor Garlic grows? If the previous professor was anything like her, I'd imagine they're not exactly harmless. Um, if it's like Mandrix or something like that, I ain't scared. Very well. If I'm in the area, perhaps I shall take a look. Grand. I'd very much appreciate it. Come and find me if you get the proof. I shall be forever in your debt. Yeah, you will, actually. Um, and I'm gonna hold you to that. Believe it. Hmm. Hidden herbology corridor. Sounds intriguing. It does. It does. Real talk. So, alright. Hidden herbology corridor is on the other side of the map. God dang. We, alright, we might have to rock with that later. So, y'all are gonna have it. You know what that means. If you want to peep that next episode about the hidden herbology corridor, then you're gonna have to smash that sub button, my guys. Nah, it's cool. Um, but definitely. It sounds interesting enough, but I want to get back to the main story quest. So yeah, rip. Venomous Valor. Yeah, it's only for like a an aesthetic, so I ain't stressing it. Back to the task at hand. Let's go see Professor Fig in his classroom. Ah, there you are. How you doing, Professor? Talk to me. Hello, sir. You'll be pleased to know that I worked on my defensive magic with Professor Heckard. So I hear. She tells me you've taken rather well to your new wand. You must continue to work with her and your other professors to improve your skills. Yes, sir. That said, I don't wish to postpone our visit to the library any longer. So, shall we proceed? Fig! I have work for you. Come. Headmaster, I'm with a student and my schedule Your schedule will wait indefinitely, as will your student. I would think that after all the trouble you caused me with Osric, you'd be eager to make amends. My office. Five minutes. Oh, no. Professor, don't make me go in there alone. That man is exasperating. Unfortunately, our trip to the restricted section will have to wait a bit longer. But, Professor, we have no choice. It would be unwise to provoke our illustrious headmaster further. I shall find you when I've completed whatever toils I must endure. Rip! I was so ex secret though, restrict. Ah, uh, talk to Sebastian. Alright, Professor. Dang. Unless my man Sebastian's about to help me get into there a little bit earlier than usual. But then I just feel like that's going to be a whole... mentioned sneaking into the restricted section. Perhaps he'll have an idea. Oh, Not sheesh. Adventure, are we? Hey, hey, don't talk too loudly. Somebody might hear you. <laughs> secrets, mama, secrets. Oh, he's downstairs. Let's get it. Yo, I love that charm right there. All right, let's go talk to Sebastian. Oh, you want the smoke? Lumos. That's what I thought. It's so crazy that they randomly move for no reason. Sebastian, there you are. I was hoping to see you. I was in the three broomsticks after the troll attack and saw what happened with Rookwood and Harlow. Not many okay. students have Victor Rookwood's attention. No. What's that all about? Uh, I'm not entirely certain. To be honest, with you, I don't really know. But, I mean, you're a Slytherin, so I'll talk to I've you. I've never even met him. Perhaps he mistook me for another student. If you say so. I won't press you now, but you will have to tell me what's going on at some point. You might need me. So, why were you looking for me? I need to find something for Professor Fig, but it's in the restricted section of the library. <laughs> he can't get it himself? He was called away by Black at the last moment. I suppose I could wait to get a note from him, but... 
You want to show some initiative. Precisely. You mentioned being clever enough not to get caught in the restricted section. And I am. Meet me outside the library tonight, and tell no one. What will happen if we're caught in the restricted section? Detention, no doubt. But a word of caution or two will help. For one, avoid Peeves, the poltergeist. Aside from wanton destruction of property, he loves nothing more than telling on the likes of us. Okay. Avoid Peeves. How concerned should I be about the librarian? Madam Scribner doesn't take kindly to clandestine activities taking place amongst her precious books. So do all that you can to avoid her. She and I have had our entanglements, but I can hold my own against her. You may not be so lucky. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll meet you later. Interesting. Jeez. All right, so we... We... Yes, let's go. <laughs> See there? That's the door we need to reach. Okay. And those annoying prefects would love nothing more than to rat on us to Scribner. So don't let them see us. Understood? I can be sneaky. Uh, Let's go. Hold on now. There's a spell you should know. The disillusionment charm. Good for getting places you're not supposed to be. Cast I'm listening. it and you'll appear as little more than a trick of the light. Just as long as you keep your distance and stay quiet. You mean I'll okay. actually be able to turn invisible? Something like that. It's not as foolproof as a cloak, but those are expensive. And spells, spells are free. Give it a try. Okay, my guy. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Alright, this is a little bit more fancy than the other spells. Let's go. Ready? I got this. Yes, sir. Okay. So I don't need luminous, obviously. Uh oh. I open up my the disillusionment charm avoid being detected in off limit areas. I right, bet. Um this one right here, right? And I'll put it on the top. Cause I don't need luminous right now. I don't think so. But I think I will be needing a fire charm. Quieter than a job and all. Okay. Oh, it's all on me. Nearby adversaries will sense and then investigate suspicious behavior. Being caught by authority figure this will result in quest failure Hello, let's go. Easy still, enough. Librarian's still here. Quick, behind the bookcase. You told me the librarian would be gone by now. I said usually, but it'll still be all right. Do you see her desk behind me? Yeah, I see it. The key is in the drawer of that desk. Now, here's what we're going to do. I'll create a distraction to draw her away. You focus on getting the key. I'll meet you outside of the restricted section. Wait, why do we need a key? Isn't there a spell for this? Hello, Homora. That's how I always used to get in. But the librarian twigged that I knew the spell and cast an anti Homora charm on the lock. So now it's just this key. But don't worry. I said I'd get you in, and I always keep my word. Trust me. All right, my guy. I'm gonna trust you, though. 
Sheesh. Alright, you better do your thing. There's someone there. Is that you, Reeves? Oh no. Oh, she looked dead at me. I got shook for a second, ain't gonna lie to you. Let's go. That Let's go. After all, how to find that book? Yeah, that was easy enough. Oh, that one's charm to look more useful than it is. It's fooled me twice. Never judge a tone by its cover, I say. Oh, okay. Wow. Use basic casts while undetected to lure. Wait, 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 wait. Are you saying that these pictures are looking at me? Whoa, I, oh man. <laughs> okay. Aim with L2 grants precision spell targeting and re reveals additional target spell targets. That's interesting enough. Ghost, don't let her see you. Use L2. Use L2 on who? Oh. You won't, must we encounter students at all hours of the day and night? Sheesh. Let's go. All right, she went that way. Let's get on the far end of the room and turn around. Which way is she gonna go? Okay, she went back. Should be in the clear now. Skulking about. Quieter than a job or not. So what is it you've been looking for? I'm looking for a cure to help my twin sister, Anne, so that she can return to Hogwarts. Because Merlin knows everyone else has given up. Why do you think we'll find a cure in the restricted section? Does the Hogwarts matron have nothing that can help Anne? No, we've tried everyone from Nurse Blaney to St. Mongo's. But I can research on my own. No need to concern yourself with that right now. Let's focus on what you're after. Which is what, precisely? I'll know it when I see it. You're being awfully cryptic. Yeah, I don't mean to be cryptic, but... Secrets of the darkest arts. I'm impressed. That's interesting. Mm. Revelio. I'm pretty sure there's a spell that can probably mess with that, but. What the hell is that? Out 
exploring where they shouldn't be. Naughty, naughty, you'll get caught. Peeves, don't you? I'm going to tell. I'm going to tell. I'm going to tell. <laughs> oh, blast of Peeves. I've got to stop him or at least get to the librarian with a good excuse for all of this. Wait, I don't want you getting into trouble for me. I have a way with the faculty when it comes to disciplinary matters. Besides, I like having friends who are in my debt. Now go. Good luck in your search. Now, where has that damned poltergeist got to? I know just the spell to repair this armor. Sheesh. Well... If you guys want to see what happens in the next episode, you know what time it is. Make sure you smash that like button, sub to the channel, and don't miss the next episode because we're going to keep going and try and try to find our location before we get caught by peas. <laughs> it's your boy Evan M. Since HD, a.k.a. Malakip Lestrange. I'll see you guys in the next one. <laughs>